Marco Brevich into the country for me. This is almost over. I'm going to finish it. Nico, you can't do this alone. I'm coming with you. Come collect it from Firefly Island. All right. Wait there for me. They are bringing him to the cargo bay at Francis International. I do not want to be late after I've waited so long. Well, this is the big moment that you've been waiting for for so long. I hope you will not be disappointed. Disappointment is not a consideration. I have not been the same man since the day that Darko betrayed us, since I saw those things. You lost a lot of friends at day, Nico. We both did. In some way, our friends from the village were lucky. I lost myself that day too. Everything that was good and innocent in me died along with them. If I could live those hours again, I think I would have preferred to be buried in the pit along with everyone else. This is all that is left of me. What am I good at, Robin? What is my trade? I deal in death. Because that is all that is open to me. I will tell you what you are good at, Nico. You are a good cousin and a good friend. You still have integrity. No matter what you say, there is humanity in you. You still have the power to be good. It's important that you believe that. Maybe I will start to believe it when Darko is dead. That might give me some perspective. This killing will stop sometime, Nico. Once this is done, then you must begin to forgive. Think about your future instead of the horrible things that have happened to you. To us. To all of us. In the past. After this is done, then we can talk about forgiveness and redemption. Now is not the time for such conversation. This is it. This is where it all ends. Zašto? Zašto? Zato što smo bili prijatelji. Svi smo odrasli za jedno. Mitar, Dragan, Goran, Mio. Mogu da nastavim. Svio, a? We were friends, but I are never friends. Friends that Goran and his guys killed. My fucking neighbors! Because of what? Because of shit! Lies! Fucking lies! So that makes it okay? To stab your friends in the back? When everything you believe is shown to be shit, you make strange choices. Fuck you! <laughs> strange choices? How much? <laughs> A thousand. <laughs> you kill my friends for one thousand dollars. How much do you charge to kill someone? You ruined me, you fuck! I need the money. I had problems. You're a fucking junkie! Kill me then! Doing me a favor. Ah! Nico, come on. Look, let's go. Let him suffer. He knows what he did. He doesn't look like he enjoys life too much. Come on. Let's go, cousin. Where are 
am I? What is this place? You say I ruined you? You are always the killer. I just have to see that. I'm lost. I'm lost. Will you take me over to Bruce's house? I'm turning this shit off. I can't take listening to those annoying ads and DJs right now. You did the right thing, Nico. He's not off of it. Sure of it. You definitely did the right thing. Proud of yourself. Let's have a fucking party. Break out the champagne. I let the diseased, traitorous junkie live after hunting him for over a decade. Shit! Someone hand me the keys to the fucking city. There's no need to take that tone, cousin. I'm sorry. If my tone offends you, Roman. But this has been a very difficult moment for me. It took every fiber of my being, pulling in the same direction, not to kill Dargo, to not get revenge for all those lives he took away. What made you spare him? I don't know. I wanted it for so long, he would just be dead. Like everyone else from our village, I was the one that survived the first attack. Living is not easy. No. I would live to killing Darko as well. But then when I looked at him, I realized that nothing would change if I killed him. The revenge would not somehow shut the book on what I have seen. Only those who die get closure. Living do not. So you keep living. And you try to have a happy life. You, you try to move on. I try to. Yes. Do you want to come in and hang with Brucey? No. I need to be alone. Thank you for being with me, cousin. Do not mention it. Call me, Nico. The wedding is soon. Florian, I thought I should let you know. I found Darko. The guilt has destroyed him. I don't know. Somehow, it was better to walk away. You know what? I'm really proud of you, Nico Bellic. After what we've had to live with these last 12 or 13 years, I know how much it hurt you. And you walked away. I know this must be hard for you, but you won, Nico. You really did. We've got to celebrate. You're free now. Maybe a spa day? Sure, whatever. I'll speak to you soon, Bernie.